praises unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rahakodash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Peace and mercy to the house of David the elect. To you all, I say greetings. So, um, I was speaking uh, with one of the brothers. Um, you know, we were talking about uh, taking great risk uh, in this truth. You know, we're, we have put our lives on the line, man. You know, we're, we're taking a risk on so many levels by doing the work of the Heavenly Father. Okay? We've, uh, you know, we've sacrificed all. We've given, uh, we've given ourselves as bounty, you know, as a pleasing sacrifice to the Lord. You know, what is that? Romans 12 and 2. You know, we present our bodies as a living sacrifice. You know? And it says, He that loseth his life for my sake shall find it. He that findeth his life shall lose it. You know, so we we lost our lives. We gave up the ways of this world so that we may receive Yahweh Shem Shai. You know, many times we get, you know, your spirit, you get down in the spirit. You think about all the things that um, the, the demon will hop on. You think of all the things that you don't have, you know, but Yahweh Shem Shai, <laughs> he said he's going to pay us back a hundredfold, man. Right? According to Matthew 19 and 29. Okay? He said, all those that have suffered, you know what? They, they, the disciples asked, well, Lord, what we shall, what shall we get? You know, for the sacrifice that we made. And he says, you know, those that have followed me in the regeneration, you know, roughly paraphrasing, he said, uh, those that have forsaken houses and mother and father and uh brother and wife and lands, you shall receive a hundredfold for my name's sake you know all of the things that we gave up for the lord he gonna pay us that back right you know we took great risk in doing this because the thing is when we when we quote unquote signed up to do this you know not literally papers but when we signed up to do this all right you took on a great deed of whom is given much is required so the difference between that's why the Lord said He rather you cold, uh, hot or cold, because if you're not, if you lukewarm, He'll spew you out of His mouth. You know, we took a we took a risk to be hot, all right? Because if you go cold in this thing, man, you know you're gonna die. You know you're gonna perish. You know the Lord's gonna spew you out of His mouth. You know, even the, the niggas who are in the world when they when they're cold, hey, at least they cold and they stay cold. The Lord rather you be like that, man. Rather than you finding out about the truth, all right, and then spewing it out and, and acting like it's nothing and going back to your vomit, okay? What is that? Luke 19, is 9 and 62. It says, uh, he that turneth his hand, uh, uh, taketh his hand off the plow, is unfit for the kingdom of the Most High. You know? Uh, Two-thirds of our people you know, even those men that have been brought in the truth and, and turned away from the ways of Yahweh Bashri Al Shai, they are unfit for the kingdom of heaven, man. They are unfit for the kingdom and the glory of Yahweh Bashri Al Shai. You know? Because yeah, it's you know the Lord says commandments are a grievous, but we know we're we're lifting a a heavy duty by doing the works and the will of the Lord, man. Alright? But we do it gladly. Because the greatest, the greatest sensation for a prophet is to serve Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Alright? And so all those that don't they, you know, people in the world, they're too scared to give up uh, what they've what they've done uh, in the world. They want to cling on to that. Cleave on to the things that they've taken part of. Alright? But you had to, you went, we, everybody, you know, in this world, they like gambling. We took a great gamble with this thing. But we have a gamble that it's a sure, what they call it in gambling, a sure bet, a sure thing. All right? We have a sure thing through the spirit of power of Yahweh Shem El Shai. We know that his promises are going to give us the rewards that we're seeking after, man. And we took a great risk by doing so. You know, we count, that's why I said count the cost of the house that you're about to build. We had to count the cost before coming in this thing, man. Just like you gambling. When you got to, you got to, you want to place your bets, you want to place your lotto and shit, but you only got a certain amount of money. You know, you're going to bet on the numbers that you think are going to be winning numbers. 
okay? But the difference is you don't got an inside look on that. We got an inside look on what's gonna happen with our bets, with the money that we've thrown down spiritually, okay? The Lord said, hey, and that's what I'm saying now, no risk, no reward, man. No risk, no reward. If you don't wanna present your body, if you don't wanna come out to camp, you know, if you don't want to do the will of Yahweh Bashim Yahshua, if you don't want to help the body and help the brothers, you know, if you want to uh, go off with your own folly and do what feels good to your flesh, you don't want to follow the law, statutes, and commandments, you want to believe in the traditions of men, you want to celebrate all the holidays, you want to be completely consumed by the, the woes of your woman, you know, yeah, ain't nothing wrong with you loving your woman, man. The Lord loves us and we're his woman. Ain't nothing wrong with loving your love with your woman. But when you put in the he says one of the, the one of the great commandments is to love the Lord thy power with all thy strength, all thy soul, and all thy might. Roughly paraphrasing, man, that heart and our mind. Okay, so we gotta give over our uh our thoughts and our minds into your how about Shimmy Al Shai. Okay? So if you ain't got if you ain't put up no risk, you ain't gonna get no reward, man. If you thought that you can stay one with the world. All right, be happy in this place. We had a guy come up to camp talking about, you guys should be happy. Hey, we gonna be happy when, the, when our Lord redeem us, man. You know? All this momentary satisfaction is not okay. We're trying to receive everlasting happiness. Well, we ain't gotta worry about crying and, and dying and, and being in pain and, and weak, corruptible bodies. You know? Worried about cold, being cold and uh, fucking sicknesses and disease and plague we trying to reach to another level and all of you men that ain't taking no risk because you fucking afraid hey you need to fear Yahweh Bashim Yahushai you afraid of losing the parts of this world that you done grown and taken accustomed to you need to fear the Lord because this is a fearful thing to fall into the hands of the living power man so you niggas is gonna be in dire straits No risk, no reward, man. And it ain't even about the reward, man. You know, I constantly say that. The reward is doing the work itself, man. The reward is knowing that we got to find a place of grace, a, a place of mercy, and that the Lord is just not going to kill us and take our names out of the book of life, man. That's enough reward on its own, man. But he promised us the kingdom of heaven for being servants. So for our risk... For a hazard in our lives You know The Lord is like I'm going to reward you for staying diligent For sacrificing your life man Just like Yahweh Shah was rewarded For giving up his life for the children of Israel man You know And he's going to be rewarded how much more in the kingdom of heaven You know what I mean He, uh, he said every, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess man You think that Yahweh and Yahweh Shah are not going to get their glory man You must be out of your damn mind you see, our people there, they're, they don't want to listen to us. They want to gamble with uh, wickedness. And see, when you're gambling with wickedness, you're going to lose every single time, man. But your gamble, put your, hey, place your bet on your hollow about Shimmy Hour Shine, man. Hey, that's a guaranteed victory, man. All right? And we run in the race that we may win. Okay? But these these people now, they're, they're, they, they rather take the bet. That's gonna uh, give them worldly and uh, temporary satisfaction, okay? And and that's that's the way of wickedness. That's the way to, to end up with death, man. Instead of entering into life and peace. You know, I didn't want to make this video too long. It was just on my spirit, you know, to tell brothers no risk, no reward. So with that, I'm gonna give all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rachakwadash. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. Peace and mercy to the house of David, the elect. Hey, man, keep fighting, brothers. We almost out of this place, man. All right? All that we have risked, all that we have given up, all that we have sacrificed will not be in vain. All your tears, brothers, will not be for nothing. Lord willing, this lesson was edifying. Until next time, brothers, keep fighting, keep praying. I say shalom.